So I've done a good portion of the tomatoes. And I'm going to go ahead and slice it up just to show you just how easy it is. You always can cut with a knife, definitely. But I always say, if you can get toys, get them. Because it just makes your life a lot easier. And then look at it. You have all these beautiful tomatoes already cut up. So you guys can just grab them and you can just put them right inside of your sandwich. Because remember again, I can't stress it enough, you're going for convenience. But even though it's convenient, you still want good stuff for your family. That's definite. And I want to make the onions a little smaller. And this is just one medium onion. Look how much onion you can get out of it. And the onions you don't use for your sandwiches, you can use it for when you cook. I love grabbing these and just using it when I'm cooking something. And then I can just cut up another batch at night, right before I go to bed. See how nice that is? And I can just go ahead and that's ready and you can just put that in the refrigerator and this is yet another grab and go. Also one more thing, I have it in here so that you can be able to put it on your sandwich but if you have it where you're working or you need, be able, you need to be able to take your sandwich with and you'd like to have these sides, bag these individually as well. If you know you're going to put around roughly around this much on your sandwich, just bag it. And if you don't mind mixing the two together, just grab some onions and grab some tomatoes and put it in a bag and you can have a to-go bag for your onions and your tomatoes. Or you can individually bag some, just depending on, again, who you're making the sandwiches for and how you like it for it to be made. So just a quick tip.